One, two, there we go. Hi everyone. So, we all know why we're here. <laughs> God. Well, first of all, I just wanna thank you all for being here. Like, honestly, there's so many people here, like, I, it, you know, it warms my heart that there's so many people here for Sarah. And she's not here yet. She will be coming onto the stream, so don't worry. <laughs> I can see her from here. She's in the kitchen right now. Um, I think she's having a drink of water. Is she what? <laughs> I'll have to pick her up and bring her here. She has been very lethargic. Not her usual energetic self. It's almost hard to believe that, you know, her insides are shutting down. It's organ failure is what's taking her. Oh, I can see her getting comfy on the carpet. Sarah, you want to come say hello? <laughs> so, oh, thank you, Kuro. Hello, Blue Frog, Kurohime, Matt, Nep Nep, Cinebrew, Alex, Scruffy, <laughs> Samurai Fights. <laughs> Am I missing anybody? There's just, there's just so many people here, you know? It, it warms my heart that you're all here for Sarah. <laughs> Thank you so much. I do have some special treats to give her tonight. Her appetite has been a little up and down. But, um, I'm hoping that she'll have some treats. She'll, she'll have some appetite for treats. She'll have to excuse my English in a little bit today <laughs> got some of her favorite treats from you know all, all the pre previous live streams of course when treats for Sarah was always a favorite redeem here on the my twitch and it was always so heartwarming when um <clears throat> we would always end a stream with some treats for Sarah and she would hop up onto the bed right here get some biscuits Oh, are you coming here, Sarah? No, okay. <laughs> so she started to make her way over. You coming? Yeah, she's looking at me. You looking at me? <laughs> Aww. It's like she she barely has the energy that she used to, the poor little thing. Oh, here she comes. It's, it's like she knows that we're waiting for her. See, I thought I was going to have to go pick her up, but she's, st she's slowly making her way over. But I will have to pick her up to bring her up onto the bed because she doesn't even have the energy to jump up anymore, the poor thing. But she's slowly making her way over. Aww. It's like she knows. Been crying for a good three minutes. Aww. Oh, guys. Oh, that's just, honestly, it really warms my heart knowing that this, you guys have as much love for Sarah as I do. Like seriously, before the stream started, like, I, where are my tissues? I've, I've got some, yeah, tissues are down there. I've got tissues ready and everything. <sighs> you sitting in the hallway, puss? Kitten. <laughs> Aww. Honestly, if, if, if you guys feel like you're not able to stay, I won't hold it against you. Um, this entire live stream will be uploaded to my YouTube channel um, after after tomorrow so if you really feel like you can't stay then don't feel bad because this will be available to watch and if you are currently watching on my youtube then hello and thank you so much for being here <laughs> she's pretty much your coaster i know right Konoko was by myself and kazu was put to sleep I want to make sure i do the same oh thank you kuro <laughs> thank you everyone you're all so sweet honestly She's, she, here we are. she's she's still trying to make her way over. You know, she's taking, she keeps stopping every few minutes. Hi! Oh, Sarah, it's like you just know, don't you? You just, she's, she's here now, she's in the room. It's like you just know. You couldn't even wait for me to come get you. No, you just knew we had the camera rolling and you had to come, didn't you? <laughs> here she is. Oh, I've come baby pipe. Right. 
You okay, sweetheart? Are your feetsies? Good girl. Good girl. Now, I do have a towel down because um, she has been having some accidents. But I don't mind if she makes a bit of a mess, you know? She's worth it. <laughs> you look a bit surprised. Are you okay, baby? Mwah. You okay, honey? <laughs> She's just sitting there, like, you don't know what to do. You, you, you okay? Everyone's here for you. Everyone's come to... I mean, I say that with such cheer in my voice, but it's not really a happy occasion, is it? It's bittersweet. Everyone's here to give you some love, yeah? Everybody loves you. Everyone's here to give you a proper send-off, yeah? You gonna you gonna stay for a bit? Yeah, everyone's come here just for you. Aww. <laughs> she is beautiful. We can still celebrate her happy life even though we're sad it <laughs> it's coming to an end. Yeah, exactly. <sighs> Sarah's been with me for she well, since she was a kitten and since I was a very little girl. Most of my childhood memories, most of my, my best childhood memories are of Sarah. And with her nearing her end, it really feels like a chapter of my own life is coming to an end too. Little Sarah here is the reason I love cats so much. If it wasn't for her, I might not even have taken on the name Kuneko. Kuneko meaning kitten, of course. But when I was a little kid, I actually really wanted a dog and I begged my parents for a dog. And then one day my dad came home with cats. <laughs> yeah, Sarah actually originally had a brother, but he passed away um, at the age of three um, due to an accident, unfortunately. Um, his name was Jack. Jack and Sarah. But then Sarah stuck around all throughout my childhood. All through my high school years. You were always there, weren't you, baby? You look like you're not sure what to do. Oh, there you go. You're having, you're having a seat. Oh, good girl. Yes. <sighs> I didn't really plan any sort of script for the stream. <laughs> it was just a, just a final gathering, you know. And I don't know I've said it over and over again. Oh, Ichigo. Hello, Ichigo. Oh my God, there's 25 viewers. I have never had that many people in, in, in like a stream before. <laughs> thank you for coming, Ichigo. Thank you so much for being here. And Georgia, thank you for being here too. Master Chaos, hello. Thank you so much for coming. Oh, thank you, everybody. Now, I feel like I will cry at some point. Like, I'm not gonna cry yet. I kind of got it all out before the, before the stream started, but I feel like if when, when I sing that song to Sarah, because I have a song to sing for her, just even just thinking about it is like, <laughs> I feel like the tears are going to start, you know? Fire Rabbit, hello. Thank you so much for coming. Honestly, I know I keep saying this, but it's just, it's just so lovely that everyone's here for Sarah, you know? It really does warm my heart that she's brought so much joy to so many people. So many people that, you know, have, haven't even met her in person. And yet she's still been able to bring joy to you, you know, across miles, across towns, cities, even countries. And that she may never truly understand the impact that she's had. But one thing's for sure, she knows she is loved. She knows she is loved. She's been purring. <laughs> She's still purring, you know? Even though physically she does not have the same energy she used to. She purrs every time I, I give her I give her love. And even though she doesn't have the energy to like sit on my lap anymore or jump up and beg for food in the morning. She you knows I'm always here to give her love. Turbo, hello! <laughs> Oh, thank you for the raid. Thank you so much for the raid. 
Um, to those of you who have just come from the Turbo's raid, you have come at a very sad time. I am Kunako, Scotland's Meowtical Pop Idol. This is my cat, Sarah. And today we are celebrating her life um, because tomorrow she won't be with us anymore. My beautiful baby. But thank you so much for coming. If you would like to stay, even if this is your first time meeting Sarah, if you would like to stay and just give her her best wishes, you're more than welcome to. <laughs> Fungi arts, hello. <laughs> we are here to support you in this time of need. Thank you, Turbo. And thank you, everybody from Turbo's stream. Matt has told someone special to raid you. Ah, <laughs> thank you, Matt. Was it was it you who told Turbo to raid me? <laughs> thank you. I'm sorry for your cat. Thank you, Fungi. Celebrating more like crying her eyes out. I do want to keep things somewhat positive, and I know it's really hard, you know, because I know it's it's like don't get me wrong. I am I, I am very upset that we are losing our beloved cat, but I also want to celebrate the life she's had, the light and the love she's given all of us. You know, she's a wonderful cat and she, she deserves to, to go off in a special way. I already made the choice to do this for you tonight. Aw, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Turbo. Scars, how long did you have her? Her whole life. Our, our whole lives. We've been together our whole lives, basically. I, w I was very little when we got Sarah. She would have been 20 years old um, this September. Hi. So she's nearly 20 years old. Some people say don't cry because it's over, smile because it happened, but it's so much more easier said than done. It is, isn't it? Oh, honey, don't go. Do you want some treats? <laughs> I thought that'd get your attention. I thought this would get your attention, yeah? You want some biscuits? We're gonna give you some treats. Can you maybe? Oh, come on over, honey pie. Here you go. You can have some biscuits. <gasps> you got some biscuits. Oh, there you go. Truth be told, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with all the leftover cat treats. Because <laughs> we got so many of them, don't we, baby? Like, there's still like, ha like half a packet of, of cheese biscuits here. <laughs> the cat must have had a wonderful life. Oh, thank you. Hello, Sarah. Thank you for coming. Hey, baby. I have a cat and I fear the day mine goes away. I know. I always said I would dread this day. But honestly, the, the more things that I do to honor her, I, the better I feel. But that being said, it's still gonna be really hard when she goes, you know? <laughs> I ugly cry when I have to do this to my dog. Anyone who says don't cry, you <laughs> should break their arm and try not to cry, I know. You wanna lick my fingers? You wanna lick my fingers? Oh, he's licking my fingers! I'm gonna miss that. Yeah? Yeah? Oh, what time is... She... Her vet appointment is four o'clock. Four o'clock UK time tomorrow. Are you okay, honey? Are you, are you... All right, she wants she wants to go for a break. Go on then, honey. You go for a little break, okay? We'll bring her back one more time before the end of the stream. But I think she wants to go to the bathroom. Yeah, she's going into the bathroom. Poor Bab. She does, she has been struggling to get to her litter tray, but you can tell she's still doing her best, you know? You gotta, you have to appreciate that she's doing her best, aren't you, baby? I should probably go check on her. <laughs> when my cat passed away in the vet room, his pupils went really huge and his tongue poked out really far. Oh, <laughs> oh thank you. Hello, toy stuffing. Thank you for sharing this with us. Oh, well, thank you all for being here. Honestly, I am I am overwhelmed by the, the number of people that are here right now. I never expected this kind of response, you know, for Sarah. 
Sarah? Hey? Hey, baby! <laughs> I think she might have just, um, gone to the bathroom on the floor, so I might have to go and check. Hey, baby! You doing okay? Oh, you... It's okay, baby. Ooh. You wanna come back? There we go. Here you are, honey. <laughs> it's alright. I'd rather she did it in the bathroom floor where the floor is lino rather than the carpet. But even it, but she has had a few whoopsies on the carpet, but you can't get mad at her, you know? No. Oh. You purring. You purring. You purring. <laughs> We all love you and Sarah so much. Oh, when I get my own house, first thing I will do is get a cat and a dog. <laughs> Aww. I know. They really are like family, huh? We should make this an annual event. The remembrance of Sarah. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? Honey pie, you wanted to leave already? <laughs> I guess I shouldn't make her stay. But I will bring her back before she has to go. But she's just sitting there. She's sitting on the carpet. What are you even doing? It's like, why not just sit up here? Oh, I, uh, yep, I think she's... She's had a little pee on the towel. <laughs> it's okay. Like I said, sometimes she, it's not like she's not even aware she's doing it. You can't get mad at her, though. Baby. She's just sitting there on the floor. Like, for real? For real, Sarah? <laughs> oh, I swear I will never understand that puss cat. But she's so sweet. Sarah's part of the reason you started your channel in the first place, right? She was a very heavy inspiration for my entire cat theme. So my my idol name of Koneko, meaning kitten, and my entire love of cats is entirely because of Sarah. Because growing up, I actually always wanted a dog. Oh, she's lying. Oh, oh honey, did you get your claws caught in the carpet? <laughs> growing up, I always wanted a dog. And when my dad came home one day with a cat, I was really disappointed. <laughs> but she really grew on me. I still remember that first day we bonded when she came into my bedroom and I was like, hey, you, go away. You know, I, 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 was, must, I must be very little at the time. This is one of my earliest memories and she wouldn't go away. So um, I, I was a little kid. I didn't really understand, you know, how to cat. <laughs> So I got one of my favorite blankets at the time, you know, when you're a little kid you have this blanket you always carry around with you. Well I got my blanket and I wrapped her up in it and she started purring and I feel like that was the first day I really felt a special bond with her and I always remember that day. That's when we had our special bond and I feel like I've been close to her ever since. What will your life be like now without her? I don't know. <laughs> it's really hard to say, you know? She's a part of the family. And it will be like losing a member of the family, you know? One day, I would like to get another cat. Although no one could ever replace Sarah, you know? But someday, I would like to give another cat the same, the same lovely life that Sarah's been able to have. Although I don't know when, I don't, I don't know when that will be, because of course, you know, I, I, I can't get another cat so soon after, after the loss of Sarah. You know, she's just sitting on the carpet. Sarah, why don't you come in here? We've got a little throne for you and you're sitting on the carpet. <laughs> I'm like, no, she's, she's irreplaceable. She's irreplaceable, we can never replace her, although one day I would like to give another cat the same the same loving life that she's had. My cat just jumped up beside me and started purring. Oh, maybe she's come to say hello to Sarah. Well, she, he. <laughs> Aww. Sarah, I love you. Aww. Me and my mom didn't get another cat after Bob, partly because still sad about him, but also because of the country road right next to our house might be a hazard for a not so savvy animal. It will not be the same without her. I know. It's understandable. Take your time. Thank you, fungi. I'm trying to convince my husband to get a cat, but he's allergic. Oh no! <laughs> I mean, if he's allergic, I can sort of understand, but 
Maybe another animal? I mean, is he allergic to all animals? Or just cats? Get one of those hairless cats! You can get hairless cats! Because if, if it's the fur that he's allergic to, you can always get one of those hairless cats. He's a he. Ah, he's a he. Oh, maybe he came to say goodbye to Sarah. It's a sacrifice I'm willing to make for a cat. <laughs> Maybe a lion cub. Hmm, I feel like that would come with risks beyond just allergies. <laughs> anyway. I have written a special version of my original song, Kitten, which was released on October 2nd last year and heavily featured Sarah in the music video that will be dedicated to her. Um, the song will be released tomorrow on my band camp. It is called Kitten, Sarah's version. All proceeds from the song will be donated um, to a cat rescue centre in Scotland. So through, with, through Sarah's memory it is my hope that we can honour her by helping other cats to find loving homes. So again, that will be on my band camp tomorrow. Meowjicalconeco.bandcamp.com Kitten, Sarah's version. Will you cremate her? Um, she's having a burial. Although I have cut, cut off some of her fur to use in trinkets and charms that I will keep for myself and for any family members who may want one. But she will be getting a burial in um, my parents' garden where she spent a lot of her younger years playing. <laughs> I've binge watched your videos on YouTube. I remember the story of how you named her after Sarah from Ed and Neddy. That's like my biggest shame. <laughs> it's clear how much of an impact Sarah's had on your life. Seeing someone I consider so close to be dealing with the loss of someone so dear, it's painful. Thank you, Cinebrew. But yes, I would like to sing... I would like to sing, um... Sarah's song. I'm gonna go and see if she'll come for it. <laughs> Sarah! to come for this? I'm gonna sing a song for you, baby. Yeah? Maybe you want some food? Oh, there you go. Good girl. Well, let's see if I can make it through this song without bawling my eyes out, shall we? <laughs> this is Kitten, Sarah's version. Now intertwined And though our 
time is near its end We will smile Cause you will always be my friend So let's smile Even if the world tells us It's wrong to feel this way We can fly if we try I won't let them take our love away now But even if we can't escape the sorrows of today Yes, I know tomorrow is another chance to break away now Shall we promise here and now that we will meet again somehow? My kitten She actually made it through that. Barely. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. I came so close to making it through that without crying. <laughs> Fuck. I don't... Flippin' heck. <laughs> Cry out loud. I came so close to making it through that without crying. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, well, at least I made it through the song though, right? <laughs> Crying out loud. <laughs> For goodness sake, Sarah. <laughs> I didn't swear, I promise. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> well, thank you, everybody. <laughs> you guys are so sweet, honestly. It, it makes me so happy that you guys have all been here for Sarah, you know? And that she's been able to bring so much love to so many people. But none more than me. Life won't be the same without you, baby. But I'm glad that I'm able to honour her in this way, you know? Alright, where did I put that tissue? <laughs> Got it. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay, I promise. <laughs> it shows that you care. Yeah, I was... I was, I'm, I'm almost kind of glad that I cried because I was worried that if I didn't cry that people would think I, I didn't care. <laughs> but I do. I just don't want to upset. I just don't want to be too upsetting. I know this is a very upsetting time, you know, but still. <clears throat> I dropped my phone twice because my hands were too shaky. Aww. Thank you, Kuro, Samurai Thighs, Master Chaos, Fungi Arts, Blue Frog, Turbo, Sara, Matt, Toy Stuffing, Cinebrew, Georgia, Scruffy. God. <laughs> You've got so, so many people love you, Sarah. Although, as much as I hate to say it, it is almost time for this live stream to end. Where did I put my water? Here it is. <laughs> I knew I had water somewhere. <clears throat> I remember when I first met Sarah at your house, old house in that town. Gave her treats. I remember when we used to sit in your room and cuddle her. <laughs> I know, she's adorable, isn't she? Oh, she's just so relaxed, aren't you, baby? You're such a relaxed baby. Yeah? I remember when I saw her online. <laughs> but yeah, tomorrow afternoon is her final vet appointment. This time tomorrow, 
she'll no longer be with us. And that's, I don't know if I really fully processed that yet. <laughs> oh, I'm okay. Thank you for asking. I'm okay. <laughs> But even if it was just online, you know, it warms my heart knowing that she's brought so much love to people across so many diff across so many different places in the world, you know. And you know you're loved. So many people love you, Sarah. My tears just broke through my search for Lane. Oh. I wish I could give Sarah catnip. She actually doesn't like catnip. I tried her with some catnip, but she actually doesn't like it. So we've got like loads of catnip in, in, like, in a bag and I don't know what to do with it because she doesn't like it. <laughs> no, I don't like it. Then again, we've got a lot, I've got lots of cat treats I don't really know what to do with. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, won't we? Anyway, as much as I hate to say it, it is time to go. It is time to wrap things up for today. But thank you. Thank you all so, so much for being here for Sarah. And for all the love you've given her over the years. Hang on, I'm going to bring her up to the camera. For one final goodbye. Thank you so much for all the love you've given her over the years. She knows that she is very loved. She's even purring. She's purring in my arms right now. She knows how loved she is. And thank you all for being here for her. I don't really know what to say to end this here. But thank you all so, so much. For all the love. I don't know what else to say. See, not normally when a stream ends, I'm like, Bye, yeah, see you again soon. But this is different, you know? But I will keep you updated tomorrow when, when Sarah goes. And of course, the, the song dedicated to her will be released on my band camp tomorrow. And of course, all the proceeds from that will go towards uh, a small cat rescue centre here in Scotland. To give, to give more cats a chance to have a, a loving family and a loving life like Sarah has. So thank you so much to each and every one of you. And I'll see you again very soon. Take care. <laughs>